Dude, you want to know what's OP? The freaking bee! Let's go! Hello everyone, time to grind here and today I wanted to play some more Super Auto Pets and we're gonna just do good old Arena because I think Arena is honestly like the best way to play the game right for the uh, you know kind of timing. It was fun checking out Versus last game mode and getting some amazing builds but um, let's go ahead and get uh, Ant into Pig into... Ooh, Beetle's really good just in terms of the stats of it. Give Shot Pets... Um, sell, give two random hell. Um, we're gonna go beetle just in hopes of, um, doing real good early, early on. And, uh, we're gonna be the, uh, we're gonna be the hard hipsters. <laughs> we're gonna be the hard hipsters. Also, one of the best parts about the entire game is the, uh, the naming thing. Okay, so big stats. I think it depends. If you could give my, come on, give it to my pig. There we go. Okay, so we tie. Cool. So that's, that's okay. Um, I'm okay with a tie. Just, well, anything... To get me past the early game, right? Um, pig. Oh, ladybug. We've we've made ladybug pretty OP before. Um, buy food gets it plus one plus one until end of battle. You know, let's go ahead and do that. Let's do ladybug. Let's feed it a one one. Ladybug is gonna secure us our early game. I think we'll go ahead and get a pig as well. Reroll. Um, bluebird. Oh, bluebird's actually kind of tempting, but um, let's see here. One one. We'll just, just call it a day like that. Um, ladybug, ladybug is. I, I feel like I need to just figure out. The, the biggest thing for me is I need to figure out a way to do early game better, right? I, I tend to know like decent uh, late game strats, but past early game, or past like the early game itself is kind of where I struggle. Um, and I guess we're tying again here, uh, which once again, guess I'm okay with. He had a fish that was um, getting close to level two. Um, okay, so pig. Not the one that I wanted to be leveling up here, but, um, uh, let's go ahead and sell the B. I don't know. I don't know. The pig is, ugh. I don't think we level it up. Honestly, I don't think we do. I don't think we do. I'm going to go ahead and apple the ladybug. Yeah, let's let's buff up this ladybug. Oh, okay. Uh, dog friend summon gets one one. Let's go ahead and ladybug, and then we're gonna do a peacock, I guess. Um, we'll go ahead and sell a pig to get the ladybug. But now I kind of just have because I don't want the dog. Uh, start a turn. Give shot pets one one swan. Let's sell. Oh wait, they changed how the health system works. It's no longer five. Okay, so the health is is back to okay. Okay, that's interesting. Um, hmm. I kind of want that swan, but I kind uh kind of want. Okay, well, first of all, let's sell the pig, right? I think we're gonna take the swan because it's really good stats. I think that's a really good early game thing. Um, I don't think we really need the ant. I don't think. I'm gonna want the ant too too much. So I don't know. Maybe we try to get a peacock build going on. I don't know. But that's oh, he's doing that thing where you just buff up the fish uh early on. Uh, which is is decent. Oh, that's un oh okay, no, no. Yeah, so we're at least we'll have the beetle. Are we even gonna be able to do this here? We're not. We are not. We're gonna take a we're taking an L here. Taking an L. That fish was crazy. That fish was crazy. Okay. Um, but we have, uh, let's see here. Mosquito, tabby cat, give food, uh, friends one one till end of battle. Flamingo, give the two friends behind it one one. You know, maybe we, maybe we do that here. Maybe we do that. So let's go ahead and sell the beetle. We're going to flamingo here. I don't think we buy food for the ladybug anymore. Um, I think we want to start buffing up the peacock. Unless we just commit to the ladybug early on, but I don't think that's kind of a waste, right? Like, if we could buff up this peacock here... Um... I will... I don't need the ant. Honestly, at this point here, I mean, it would be nice if the ant could buff the peacock. But... I don't know, give me that swan instead. Just give me a bunch of money next turn. Um, deal two to all... 
Now that could work. No, it couldn't. No, it couldn't. I mean, it would trigger the peacock, but where would I put it, right? I don't know where I'd put it. Um, rat, uh, meat bones, pretty interesting. Actually, you know, we'll go ahead and freeze meat bone. We'll go ahead and freeze meat bone. Because we could give that to the flamingo, so the, that way the flamingo's actually perps- Hey, they got two swans as well, though his swans are- His swans are way more powered up than- Okay, yeah, I think- I think we're not in a very- We're not in the, uh, strongest of positions here. Actually, Peacock might be able to- Oh, 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 there we go, we got the tie! Oh, no, because- Oh, the melon armor! The melon armor! Okay, okay. So we are- we lost, what was that, two? So now we're gonna be losing three per- holy cow, okay. Um, let's go ahead and buff the flamingo. We're gonna give the flamingo meat attack there. Oh, I forgot. Yeah, ladybugs just if anyone eats. Um, snail. Um, if you- Oh, if you lost last battle, give all friends 2-1. Okay, yep. Yep. Let's go. Boop. That's very helpful. Then I think we're going to sell the snail. And we're gonna give garlic armor to the peacock. Okay. Okay. There we go. That was a big power spike. That was a big power spike. Snail snail is a cool catch-up mechanic. Start a battle, deal one damage randomly. It's fine. Make an enemy weak. That's whatever. I'm glad you just didn't take one of the items off one of my guys. There's a lot worse people it could have been, right? A lot of worse people. Flamingo's clearing out a lot of people. Um, oh, nice. Because the bee... We're able to hit the peacock there. Let's go. Finally got our first win. Holy cow. We'd only tied or <laughs> lost things. Um, okay. Another flamingo. Let's do that. Because now it's going to give two, two. That's that's kind of crazy. Um, so I'm going to check with the... With health... Uh, with health... And the same... Oh, that... Okay, with... Oh, with one health and the same attack as this. Okay. I feel like we can incorporate that. Pretty well. Let's go ahead and get the swan. Friend summon, give it 2 2 when not in battle. I think we're just gonna reroll peacock, freeze that. Snail, do we? I'm gonna freeze the snail just in case. No, I, we're not losing. I'm that confident. We're not losing. We ain't losing. Who do you think I am? Okay, so. Problem is, we gotta buff this rooster. So, five. So I think what we're actually doing now is even though it would be awesome to get a super buff ladybug, I think we start letting it hit the rooster. I think is the play. I think that's the play. Because it's that's more value, right? Oh, he's they're trying to do the caterpillar thing here. It's always cool just going up against different builds, right? Versus is interesting because you have the real time thing, but oh nice. We that that meat attack thing. Um, it's cool to try out, like, or just constantly see what a bunch of different builds are happening and stuff. See, then we had the rooster as well. Yeah, I'm glad we didn't, um, buff the or get the snail. Um, okay, ooh. Do we go a caterpillar, though? First of all, obviously doing peacock here. Um. Give all current and future shop pets 2-2. That's kind of insane, actually. Um, I kind of want this garlic armor as well, maybe, uh, maybe to the ladybug, but I don't think we're going to keep the ladybug for very often, right? I feel like we would keep this swan more than we would keep that. So let's go ahead and do canned food. Um, let's go ahead and garlic. Spending a lot of, a lot of money on food, but apparently I, I know that that's something I need to do better. Okay, so we're going to have a peacock here. Uh, in turn, if there's at least a level three friend, I don't feel like we're close to a level three friend at all. I don't think we're- I'd love to do that. Um, I'd love to do that, but I don't think so. Um, and turn if you have four or less pets, two, two. Well, no, no. Let's just lock the pair. Because we want to start buffing that rooster. We really want to start buffing that rooster. Okay. Okay. I We got a lot of food that I think is going to help the hard hipsters here. Quite a lot. Okay. Let's see. Start up. Oh, okay. So, you, once again, one of the better people it could have been. That fish got a bunch of good trades. Oof. Oof. Okay, so we'll... This peacock's going to at least trade... Oh, I thought it was going to trade with the top two. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Oh, yikes. Ooh. 
We can only lose one more time now, and then it's over. Okay, well, we can get a rooster. And we can get a rooster. Summon two chicks. That's actually... It's kind of insane. Um, I think we go ahead and let's get rid of the ladybug. I think. I think it's time. We're gonna get the cow. Even though this is... Oh, I should have bought the pear first. Whatever. Okay. Um, I think at this point we commit to... I think the rooster is what we commit to more. We gotta, we gotta commit to the rooster more. It's nice having the peacock or whatever, but... Don't think it's a necessity here. Um, let's go ahead and lock that flamingo. Um, okay. Okay. Th I now think we're in an even better position, but once again, we only have two wins. We only have two wins. This isn't, uh... Two damage to Peacock. Hey, that's, that's perfect. That's exactly who I wanted it to be. Oh, yeah, we're destroying these people. We're destroying this these people here. Yeah, flamingo. The flamingo and chick. The flamingo and rooster strat here. Is that the is that the new strat? Oh my god! Because then I got two thirteen twos. Let's go. Okay, so um, yeah, having twelve money is kind of nice. So buff the flamingo. The I think we just keep buffing up the rooster. I think the the peacock's a nice little side effect, but not um, the priority here. We're getting close to a level three, but we're not there yet. So, oh, but there's two of them though. But I don't, I don't think it's, we're not, we're not there yet. We're not there yet. Um, oh, garlic armor on the rooster. Yeah. Yes, please. Yes, please. Um, three random pets. I think we'll, yeah, we'll go ahead and freeze sushi. Sushi's pretty good. Um, okay. Okay, flamingo rooster strat. It's gonna it's gonna do it here for us. It's gonna carry us Okay, so now we have a 1550 with garlic armor first of all that in itself is Actually going to just oh what you you have one chicken look at what I'm gonna get dude. I got two 15 twos That's insane That's insane. Okay. Yep sweet, and then we have the cow. Okay, let's do this So we're at three wins here now once again, we can't lose at all um, I'm gonna go ahead and sell the cow because I don't want the cow to get this benefit of the sushi. Hey, perfect. Perfect. I got the peacock and the rooster, which is all I could have asked for there. Um, honestly, let's, let's commit to the swan here. Um, let's go ahead and buy the owl and then sell it. Um, gave it to the flamingo. That's all right. Um, to roll a single time. Ooh. Um, I think we're just gonna pair the chicken or the rooster. I keep calling it the chicken. It's creating chicks. Um Okay. Okay. Let's do this here. Maybe I should have the swan in the back. I don't know. Okay. Oh, that 2827. That's gonna be interesting here. Cause I'm gonna do 18. Okay, see, but there we go. I get two 18 twos. So let's see. Is it gonna be good enough here? Oh no, no, rip. Oh, the game runs over, runs over, no. Oh, game over turn 10. Oh man, okay. Okay, 505 points. Okay, well you know what that means? This is, we can finally afford a background here. We can finally afford a background. So what we're gonna do here is we're gonna, we're gonna buy, we're gonna buy the snowy mountain. That's what's gonna allow us to win the game here. That's what's gonna allow us to win the game is this snowy mountain. Um, okay, fish, one of my favorite early games. Honestly, what if we do the fish, we do the pig, and what if we just, what if we just like buff up the fish? Oh, oh my gosh. Two fish, okay. Well, that's kind of insane. Okay, um, we're going to be the, uh, the moist muffins. Or the moist muffins. Moist muffins are gonna do it here for me. Moist muffins are gonna do it here. I don't know. I should have had the three four first. I'm already getting a loss. <laughs> I'm already getting a loss. Oof, but I don't think I'll I think I'll actually get some early game. So I only lost one health though. What is what is this fish thing? What? 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 That's insane. That's insane. Okay, well mate, we're gonna do an early. We're gonna do an early uh, build here then with all these fishes. Holy cow. 
Holy cow, that is a lot. Someone's gonna first my team, my moist muffins, and just be like, what in the hell? Oh, okay, we tied. We didn't even win, we tied. Once I level these fish up, though, that's the thing. I just want to wait because it obviously buffs up other people here. Um, pig, don't really want that. Each shop food gives friends one attack until end of battle. You know what? Yeah, let's let's do that here. Um, let's. I don't want to level anything up yet, but let's tabby cat here. We're gonna give it a. Uh, actually, let's do the bluebird. I'm gonna do the cupcake. Okay, th I gotta win this game, right? I mean, there's no way I somehow lose. What? What? No way. No, I mean, that's already one, two, three, four, five, six. We've already gotten a full level two fish next turn. That is crazy. Um, do we give up the bluebird then just for one of the fish? I think we do. Sell. That is crazy. This is crazy. It's the, it's, the, it's the snowy mountains here. That's what it be. Okay, is that peacock? Yeah, congratulations, you're gonna kill. Oh, that actually, mm. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Tabby Cat actually survived here. Oh, then he's got a ladybug. I didn't even see the ladybug. Am I still losing? Okay, well, I guess this, this is all a setup. This is a setup here for when we can do something later. I just, I suck at early game. Okay, I thought I was about, I was about to freak out saying I got another fish. Um, I think we just keep doing this. Problem is I don't want to level them up yet until I get someone that I actually care about. Um, so let's go ahead and get, do I do meat bone? Let's do meat bone for now. I just gotta, Oh, does that not count as... Oh, the tabby cat has to be the one eating the shop food. Okay, you know what? Yeah. Just want to buy myself some time here. Oh, I did, I did not mean to love... I did, I did not mean to do that. I always try to move the orders of where they're at. We're already almost to a level three. Okay, let's let's get the... Freeze the caterpillar because... That could be kind of insane, quite honestly. If we get like the buffalo of like having a level three or something, that could be that could be pretty good here. Okay, that's fine. The problem is, is the melon armor there, dude. I think I'm getting another loss, dude. Okay, I, I get that I'm not doing well, but I think I think this can still work. So let's go ahead and start getting the caterpillar. Leveled up. Um. Oh, snail. Okay. Um. I guess we do the snail, right? And I guess just for the time being, give the tabby cat. Oh, we'll sell the snail. Give him the garlic armor. This is not going well here. This is not going well. I could have a level three fish here though, right? Or no? No, I think I need one more fish for a level three fish. Oh, there's the melon armor, man. Okay, actually, I think we're fine. We finally got a win, holy cow. My army of fishes will actually allow me to get a win here now. There's the fish, okay. Um. I don't know if the tabby cat is a good play or not. Um, let's go ahead and get the fish, obviously. Um, are we, we're not at, we're at, I think we gotta wait until we're at uh, tier three to get the buffalo. I think, so maybe I should just be doing food. Um, yeah, I'll just salad bowl. Oh, I should have actually fed the tabby cat. That would have been the, that would have been the better play. Um, 
Yeah, and I guess it's good that we got the caterpillar early we, uh, because we accidentally leveled up the fish and got the caterpillar. Because if we are going for the buffalo infinite scale strat, it's not a half bad strat to do it on, right? That melon armor is gonna suck. Oh, he's oh he's clearing both of the fish that we needed there. Are we fine though? We at least, uh... dude, we won, we won. Let's go, let's go. The army of fish will uh, prevail here. Okay. Uh, rhino, wow. Because it leveled up, it gave me a rhino here. Um, I think let's go ahead and do that. I have beyond a level three or whatever. Okay, let's get the rhino. Another fish. Um, okay, at this point, yeah, let's go ahead and let's go ahead and combine up this. Um, oh my gosh. Okay, so we're gonna do the cow and give it all to the rhino. So when he knocks out, deal four damn. Okay, yeah. Let, I think we just try to buff him a lot. Um, I want. I think we just hard re-roll for the 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 infinite scaling buffalo guy. I think that's what we ultimately do here now. Um, what order do I want these in? I think that's an okay order. Maybe we put the cow behind just in case. Caterpillar can make a trade. Cow will survive. Okay, let's do this. There we go. That it's knocking out even with the um, garlic armor. So vamp four damage, which doesn't matter actually. So Rhino effectively didn't matter, but if we keep buffing him up, it, it could matter, right? It could matter. Okay, okay. You know what? I think we've gotten so much stat effects from. Maybe that's the problem. Maybe we were waiting to level up the fish, and if we had just leveled them up, you know, it would have been better. Okay, buffalo, not what we're wanting. Let's go ahead and. Bu I don't know. I want to just hard roll. Um, actually, we'll garlic armor the rhino. We'll pair the rhino. Come on, give me. I, I, I stop tempting me with these. There we go. There's the bison. Um, we gotta just wait though. There, we just gotta wait. Um, so we're going to bison. I'm gonna go ahead and freeze the pair as well. Okay. So we got it. Next turn, we'll have infinite scaling because of the level three fish. Um, that is an interesting, interesting. At least he was able to make the trade. What is this guy's build? It's like actually kind of scary, but like we're fine, but it's kind of scary there. Okay, let's do this. Nice. Okay. So we're gonna sell the cow. We're gonna buy the bison. Um, which we're already about to get a caterpillar here. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and chocolate the bison. We're gonna pair the rhino. Um and I think we just hard reroll for things that we want. Like sushi? Sushi's pretty okay. Splash attack though? Nah. Yeah, I don't I don't see anything I specifically want, so. Okay, bison scaling. Bison starting to scale already. And we're already about to get a caterpillar here. We're already about to get a caterpillar here. Nice, four day okay, well a lot of these times they're not actually mattering. Yeah, it's not actually mattering really. But I mean, I got, I mean, he's like a level five, right? Like, I feel like investing in him is probably an okay idea, right? Just kind of on the side. Oh, that's unfortunate. Oh, that is unfortunate, because now we're tying. I didn't lose, but that was, that was unfortunate. Okay. So now we got the butterfly. Copy the stats, the strongest boy. Um, I kind of want to give him splash attack. Maybe that's better, but I feel like he works better with the armor. Um, though maybe I give it to the caterpillar? I don't know. No, well that's not gonna, I ain't gonna do nothing. Rhino, yeah, we need to level him up. Um, honestly, cupcake, that's fine. And uh, chocolate, freeze, chocolate's one of the best. Um, because the caterpillar will be a 1920, right? Until that uh, bison uh, out levels or whatever it's called. Oh, he got weak. That's 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 probably okay. Oh, that was a that was a yikes trade right there. That was a yikes trade. I think we're still fine, even though. Cause yeah, we got this now. Butterfly. Butterfly is OP, dude. Butterfly is OP. Let's go. Okay. 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 
I think we can do this here. I don't want to get cocky because we only have five health here. Um, okay, Gorilla Hurt. He gains Coconut Shield. Um, I think, I don't know. Buy Tier 1 Pet. I don't know. Let's just commit to what we have, maybe. We, we could technically abandon the fish if we wanted to after all this because we have the Caterpillar level 3, but... Um, so I, I want to give it to the Rhino, but I feel like the correct answer is giving it to the Bison. Leveling up that Bison. Um, we're not really buying... Oh, there we go. There's the Rhino. Now it Okay, now it's dealing 8 damage to the first enemy. That's insane. Um, oh, I'd love to buy the Cow, but... Do we get rid of the fish? I feel like the fish having bone attack is probably okay. I don't even know what we would sell. Actually, okay, the tabby cat. The tabby cat's kind of... I think we would sell the tabby cat, if anything. Yeah, let's let's go ahead and do that now. We're going to sell the tabby cat, buy the cow, and then we're going to use the milk on the rhino twice. He's a 2122, which means that caterpillar is turning into a 2122 as well. Um, I think we're going to go ahead and put the cow at the back. I think that tends to be the play. Um, if you have any just like weak people, I think it makes sense to put them at the end just in case the things in front of them made a good trade so you can have one thing left over to technically win the game for you. Uh, buy food, gain one gold three times, whatever. Dude, okay, so now eight damage. And then that's gonna be it because they got a freaking buff dog over here. What? Oh no, he's killing our butterfly. Oh, we lost. Oh, snap, we lost. Okay, I got humbled. I got humbled real fast there. We can't lose anymore, guys. Uh, give a pet extra life. Don't know who that would help. Um, hmm. Oh, steak attack. There we go. Yeah, attack for twenty more damage once. That's that's the uh, that's the better way. That's the better bonus. Maybe I should have given that to something else. I don't know. But oh my! I, keep keep giving me these freaking steaks here. Yeah, sure. Um, I think eventually we want armor on the bison though. Um wait, 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 wait. Give him the stake attack. So he's guaranteed to get something there. Okay, we're gonna freeze both of those. Um, start a battle, deal 50% attack damage to random enemy. Yeah, okay. Okay, he's getting plus four, plus four. I mean, it's just we gotta just survive a couple of these, right? Okay, so 21 damage. That's 21-22 that we get the eight damage it's another one of these buff guys here but i got steak attack on my fish there we go that's there we go we got that win here right no no are you kidding me are you kidding me no no how could i not like this okay okay well that was a fluke we're doing this one more time here that was a fluke uh <laughs> Um, that was kind of crazy though. How many fish we got offered last time? Um, okay. Um, Beetle's got good stats, right? Really does. So what if we Beetle? This is an interesting play. What if we then give it honey? Which made these things even bigger. Um... So then I'm going to buy a 2-3. I'm going to freeze that ant because it has increased stats. Um, Ant, cricket, mosquito. Yeah, I guess. I never really know what to do with the early game stuff. Um, okay, we're going to be the... Uh, we're going to be the... Uh, the naughty... Uh, the naughty teapots. Why not? What a name. What a team name. What a team name. Okay, the naughty teapots here. We got, we got waste. Oh, we hit the bluebird. That was good. I think we needed that to happen here. Let's go. And we win because of the freaking bee. Let's go. First, I mean, I struggle so hard early game, so that's pretty nice. Um, okay, what if we ant? And then we... Um, actually, we should have bought the... Uh, I don't even have enough. I mean, two bluebirds. That's kind of crazy. That's kind of crazy. Um... I think we're just going to buy the bluebirds. There's a fish. That's, it, I, I didn't get offered fish enough for that to be worth it, I don't think. Um, so who do I want to be the leftmost person, right? 
Um, probably the beetle, just because we've committed the most to him. I don't know. Unless we, yeah, I, yeah, I don't know. Early game, early game to me is is hard. But the fact that we got two birds, that thing's a four three. It's kind of crazy. Kind of crazy here. Okay, one damage. Snipe the bird in the back. Let's go. Best possible outcome there for us. Best possible outcome. Okay, so he's got a bunch of buff dudes here. Oh, wait a minute. Because that's going to kill the bird. No, we're fine. We're fine. You want to know why we're fine? We're fine to the freaking bumblebee. Bumblebee's the most OP thing ever, apparently. Apparently. Okay. Um, let's, Mosquito, uh, buff up one of the bluebirds, I guess. I think it's too late for the fishes. I'm sorry. You had your time to shine. Um, do we give it to the ant? How much are we keeping the ant around, right? Like... I would rather give it to... Oh, you probably want to give it to someone with a lot of health, right, actually? Yeah, I think unfortunately I got to give it to the mosquito here. Um... Yeah... I suppose... Okay, so maybe that thing, that thing might win us a bunch of games early on, because it's going to get a crazy last kill, and then it's going to spawn the bee. And the bee's going to constantly just get us the Ws here. That might be the play here. Dude, bone attack. Yeah, bone attack on something with a lot of health. That I got two instances out of that. Okay, he's got a B. But I'm able to clear it. I think I win this, right? Dude, I win again to the B. Dude, B's OP. What? The B's OP. The B is OP. Okay. Um... I guess we go ahead and level that up. So now we're giving it three. Um, end of turn, give five five to the friend ahead until end of battle. That's actually kind of crazy. I think we get rid of the ant. Um, end of turn, five five to friend ahead. So would it would make sense to give that to the mosquito? I think that would make sense to give it to the mosquito, right? We're already gonna get a level three bluebird here if we get one more bird. Um. Right? That's how that works? I think that's how that works. Okay. Yeah, that thing having bone armor, that's an 8-9. That's an 8-9. That's pretty freaking good. It's also dealing one damage at the beginning of the turn. Okay. Problem is that, that the, the, the hatch check or whatever... Dude, B is, oh, never mind. I thought, I forgot the rant. We're actually losing this one. I was about to go on about how the B was OP again, but <laughs> it didn't, didn't help us there. Okay, owl. Mm, yeah, why not? Let's combine those birds now. Do that, we'll just sell it. I guess, I guess that's fine because we're probably gonna keep that bird, honestly. Um, let's go ahead and give the bird, the hatching chick, a bone attack. Level three bird. Already, what? Uh, buffalo, buying, we could infinitely scale it for buying units. But I don't want that, I want the bison. I think we still try to go bison because we already have a level three. We're not level whatever yet, but... Ooh, tur okay. So the question is, do we go turtle? It offered me two turtles. I think so. Question is now, I think I still want the beetle to be the last, honestly. I want it to just be able to do a giant trade because of the bluebird buffing it and then the bee to spawn. I think that's the play. I think that's the play. Um, I think we go ahead and lock garlic armor. Well, if we're going the turtle, maybe I shouldn't have done that. Maybe I shouldn't have done that because turtle's gonna effectively be a better you know, whatever. Okay. Yeah, give me two hits here. Oh, I'm glad. Oh, that was that was good for me. Yeah, buff the guy I'm about to just insta-kill. Um, that was kind of wasted on that, but at least it actually made a trade here. 
And nice, Bluebird, Bluebird making it for us there. If he hadn't, the beetle and the bee would have. <laughs> the beetle and the bee would have. Um, another hatching chick. Okay. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Do we do turtles? I think we do. Is that a Glock? That sounded like a Glock sound effect. Um, okay, turtle. I don't think we actually want the garlic armor. Another turtle there. Holy cow. Okay. Yeah, we'll take that. We're at four wins already. We still got eight health. I think the B is just OP, maybe. Maybe the B is actually OP. Okay, that didn't really matter. That didn't matter. Yeah, the mosquitoes at this point in time obviously do not matter. Um. Oh no, he's still hitting our hatching chick. Oh no, Melian armor! I've totally forgotten. There we go. So then, just enough. Dude, you want to know what's OP? The freaking B! Let's go! Oh my gosh. Okay. Um, wow. Wow, wow. I'm getting offered a lot of turtles here. Okay. Well. Turtle? Um, Rhino, we tried you last time and you kind of were underwhelming. Not gonna lie, dude. Um... What is he even doing? Th does it just make the back three? I don't know. Kind of want the bison. Um, I also kind of want to pair the bluebird. But I feel like I should be fetching for the the buffalo now or bison. What if there it is, bison? Let's go. Okay. Do we? I think we gotta buy it now, right? We you gotta start those early. So. Do we get rid of the mosquito? I mean, what what what's 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 the grand what's the grand play here? I mean, the mosquito's doing pretty good because it's got bone attacks, three four, being buffed with the hatching chick. I would rather have the. Hmm. I. Th I think we get rid of the hatching chick, unfortunately. We get a bison here. Which, he's gonna give two armors melon armor, so we'll do it like that. Yep, there we go. Okay. Dude, that beetle in the back, I was not- Do we still haven't found another beetle there, honestly. Which, also, we could be feeding him food and- uh, it's too early, that wouldn't actually impact much. So that's gonna not make a trade. That- the mosquito is something we can- we can figure out later, but yeah. Both of those guys aren't crazy, but them both having melon armor is. Oh, you think you you think you can do the beat? Oh, the beast strat's actually uh, hitting the melon. Let's go. Let's go. Another turtle. Um. So there's just yeah no okay. I don't think I need the um that armor. If you have four less pets, gain two two. Nah, I don't want to do that. Uh, bone attack on the turtle, I guess. Oh, there's a bison, so we'll do that. Beetle, we'll do that eventually, because I think we keep him, right? I mean, he's been buffed so many times by the bluebird. Even though he's not, like, spectacular, just the fact that there's an 18-3 that's going to keep getting bigger and bigger that is summoning the bee. Uh, actually kind of pretty good. Um... Do we care about the pair? I think we're naturally scaling the people that we want naturally scaled, right? Because once again, the beetle, the, him having in, in the back, is it doesn't care how... I mean, that can be a one-shot thing, right? Because he's summoning the bee for us. That's fine. Make that trade. Melon armor, whatever. Oh, my guy gets melon armor now. Garlic armor ain't saving you there. Melon armor, melon... Dude, that guy's got two caterpillars. That's... Whoever he faces up later, the fatherly packages. Dude, we might even... Uh, dude, we're... Dude, I think the bee is actually just crazy. Okay. Let's sell the mosquito because I want this... I, the cow The cow is one of the best uh, characters in the game, I think. Honestly. Uh, who do we want to buff, though? The buff bison? Probably just get him... Um, little bit of a head start there, I think. Um, chili... I think bone attack's better than chili, right? 
Um, so I'm gonna check with the sit. Nah, it's, uh, we, we, we needed to scale that up earlier. Caterpillar would be nice for the bison, but I think that ship has sailed too, so. I think that ship has sailed. The naughty teapots versus the huge towers. Okay, so you're doing one of the turtle strats there as well. Got some. He's got some scary looking people there. Both have very similar strats. He, I think he's got some scarier people though. Yeah, I think he's gonna win it. Yeah, my B, my B can't, my B's not that OP that guys. My B's not that OP. It's pretty freaking OP, but he's not, he's not that OP. Okay, so we still have five health though. That's two more losses, right? Um. Oh my, dude, we got a, okay, snail. Do the snail, because we lost, everyone's buffed up. We sell the snail, buy another cow, cacao's OP, just keep buffing up that bison. Um, uh, uh, I think we're gonna, uh, see, I wanna, I don't know if it makes sense to, I think we do the beetle later. Um, and then we just try to reroll for things that I would want. Like a bison and a chocolate, dude. Let's go. Um, yeah, okay. Yeah, the fact that we have this strat and this infinite scaling stuff pretty early and we still have two more losses we could get, I'm pretty confident. I'm pretty confident. That's fine. Two buffalo or two melon armor here, eventually, which is gonna be three. Oh. Sucks we didn't make the trade. But, oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. You wanna know who's OP? The B is OP, let's go! Oh my gosh. That B has won us like six out of eight of these rounds here. Holy cow, okay. Um. Yeah, Bison, he's a level two. He's getting four, four now. What, whoa. Whoa, okay, this is. Uh, buy food, gain one gold works three times. What if we try to do that? What if we tried to do that? Um, the problem is that I can't, I don't have the, I don't have the, the money to make it work right now, but that would, if I, it's going to offer me two of those. I mean, maybe that's my, maybe that's my end game thing here. Miss my end game thing. So next turn, I could I could sauropod, um, and buy pizza and chocolate. Sounds like a plan. Could do octopus, but if you have three or more gold, give other friends two two. Oh, well, that's a that's the hype. That's that's a potential play as well. But I think I'd rather use food and just buff people up. I think that's the play. So that's what we're gonna say, dude. Okay. Okay. The overexcited nuts. That's who we're facing. Dude, that's a that's a buff ant. I'm glad I got some melon armor up in here. And then I'm gonna be able to kill that. Dude, I'm making two oh. Garlic armor worked better. Oh, dude, we lost. Ooh, I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like that very much. Okay, we can't lose anymore. We need either two wins or one loss and we're out of here. So, we're gonna uh, sauropod, I guess? And we're gonna chalk, actually. Let's chocolate the sauropod. Now that works six times per turn. So we're gonna pizza. I can't, I can't really do, I could, I could cow, but. I'll pizza, just, I wanna just lock in good food. Chocolate, sauropod. Yeah, okay. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I was feeling confident, but I'm... 50-50! That guy's already got a 50-50! Oh. Okay. Oh, that melon armor popped when I didn't want it to pop. I think we're... I think game's over here. Game be over. Well, I mean, we got eight wins, right? I think... I think the B... I, I'm sorry, B. You, 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 can't, you can't win them all. But that B was OP though. You can't you can't deny that that B was OP.
Man, we got we got an eight win. Honestly, I'm happy with that. I think I think maybe if I played that a little bit better, I could have gotten a ten uh, game win. Um, but I am I am just so freaking shocked at how OP that strat was. Putting a buff guy at the back that would just suicide bomb because he didn't have a lot of health, but he was getting buffed by the bluebird. Summoning that B, that's pretty crazy. It's pretty crazy in my opinion. I think that's a pretty interesting strat you guys should try out maybe. I don't know. I wasn't able to get 10 wins, but I feel like I could have. I tried it some more. So, uh, man, I, I gotta say, I've been enjoying Super Auto Pets. I know I took a kind of little break from it, but you guys seem to really enjoy the last episode I made. Um, I hope you guys enjoy this one. You know, definitely let me know if you want to keep seeing Super Auto Pets on the channel. I know there's, like, a big update of, like, a new expansion pack of one, you know, because we use expansion pack one. I like that more than the default. Uh, so they're making a new expansion pack, so, you know, excited to try that out. So, you know, let me know if you want to see more Super Auto Pets. You know, hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you guys subscribe, ring that bell like all the big boy YouTubers say to be notified when more Super Auto Pets comes out. Uh, and if you guys are going to be grinding out some Super Auto Pets on your own, then I wish you guys luck and see you all next time.